the messiness of your room. Yeah. All right. Let's see how the hydrogen peroxide works. like it right there, doesn't it? Yeah. I just don't know why that's... Big chunk is so red like that. I guess it's just from the skin. Little bird. Dirty sock. You gonna say what happened? Looks like Gert grabbed her by the wing, and unfortunately, it ripped. So we're gonna try to get the wound healing stuff and. I have to hold her while I do the blue stuff. The blue stuff gets messy, so we're gonna have to hold her sideways the way that you didn't want to hold her. No, you were you were like squeezing her. No, I was not squeezing her. I have to hold her right. Yeah, it looks like crap. I don't think it looks like crap. I'm just confused on what you did to him. So I trimmed it. I was trying to trim it because he doesn't want it super short. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know. It, it doesn't look right at all. I can see it's short it in the back. Mess. He looks like an There's anime character. The only thing like I'm worried about is character. the other chickens are going to try to... underneath part. I mean, it's gotta be look like maybe it's where it was ripped out. flesh wound it's gonna bleed I just don't want them to bugger it's the only thing does it feel warm enough yet Silkies, I guess. I say to keep leave the silkies in with her because she never had any problems with the silkies before. Yeah, I mean, honestly, know. with a wound like that, she bled a lot, so I don't. I'm sorry to say there's a chance that she might not make it through the night. I mean, that was a lot. That was a lot of blood for a little itty bitty chicken. I mean, it stopped, which is good, but.
So I went ahead and used this hen healer. And hopefully in with the baby chicks, they're not going to peck at her because most of the time when they see they see blood, they keep on little peck. So, so we put her Charlie comrades in with her. Charlie comrades? Yeah, comrade. Yeah, we're going to have to get food and water in here ASAP too. One thing I'm worried about is this straw. I mean, it should be fine, but... Oh, the straw. Nothing really. I just think it would be better for the... <gasps> the poop kind of gets soaked up easier with the pine shavings. Oh! <laughs> Patrick right. Dawes. Mm, we don't have uh, another water. There's one downstairs. Well, you took it up and used the thing for them. That's what I'm saying. We're still going to have to go out and get new ones. There's oh. one right there. Let's see what they do with this medicine on her. Or the silkies. Well, I know, but like those. They've been with the silkies the whole time. Now she's gonna get upset because they're all done. Now she's just gonna wonder where they're at. She's gonna be able to hear them, just can't see them. They don't look like their mind. They're just confused. Like, why are we in here? I have to get some food and water. I wanted to look at the other side to compare it. Did you see that? Yeah, she's jumping. No, don't pick at it yourself. Oh, shoot. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. Hey, that's what I'm worried about. I'm afraid to put it on on chicks. Not in my face. I've never put it on chicks before. So I don't know what to expect if she eats it. Bad goose. So she literally was holding her up. Yeah. By her wing. I mean, you can tell it's ripped. I mean, look how the feathers are being held down right there. This puts a lot of stress. I mean, she's only maybe five days old. It puts so much stress on them that there's always a chance it's just, it'll make her weak, you know? And then her, she's eating it. So. All right, go ahead and stop.